In this video, I'll show you how to create an affiliate tools page and publish that page on your website. This is the main dashboard of the plugin. On the dashboard, we can see the product name, the affiliate program, the affiliate link URL, the short code, and allow us to either edit or delete any one of those campaigns. The short code does all the legwork for you. After you've created your campaign, grab the short code and paste it on any page on your WordPress site. And this will publish the affiliate tools page that you build within the campaign. The plugin allows you to create two types of pages. A standard affiliate tools page that works with pretty much any affiliate program that generates a unique affiliate ID, as well as the ability to create an affiliate tools page for a product called Easy Clickmate. Easy Clickmate is a script designed to work with ClickBank. If you use Easy Clickmate, then you can create an affiliate tools page that integrates directly with your ECM site. Now, let's create a new affiliate tools page. First, give it a product name and enter the JVZoo URL. Wherever the unique affiliate ID is within that URL is where you need to make sure that you replace it with this code snippet. This is the dynamic token that gets replaced whenever an affiliate enters a unique affiliate ID on the front end of your website. Now click Save Resource Page. So the campaign's been created and now we can start adding tools to the campaign. Scroll down the page and we have a number of tools that we can select from. We can create tweets, email swipes, articles, signature blocks, banner images, other images, and rebrandable reports. We can also insert headlines and HTML code. Let's start by inserting a headline. Click on headline, click edit, and give it a title. Now let's click on emails. Edit, enter a subject line. And we would just enter the, bot, the text of the email. You can continue adding as many tools as you like. If at any point you want to reorganize the layout of these tools, you can hover over any one of them and drag and drop to change the order. And once you're done, click Update Resource Page. Return to the campaign listing and copy and paste the short code onto a page on your website. And now when an affiliate lands on that page, they'll be able to enter their affiliate ID and click Generate Affiliate Links. And then all of the promotional tools you've created will automatically have the affiliate link updated. You'll see the dynamic token has been replaced with my unique affiliate ID. And all an affiliate has to do is copy and paste these tools and they're ready to go start promoting your products. Now let's take a closer look at the rebrandable reports. Click on the rebrand reports under the toolbar. Now click edit. Setting up the rebrandable report under the affiliate tools plugin is quite easy. An image URL is useful for showing an image of the rebrandable report on the affiliate tools page. 
You'll first need to upload that image into your media folder and then grab the URL and paste it into this field. Next, you need to enter the URL where your PDF report is currently sitting. So you've uploaded it into your medias file, grab the URL there and paste it into this field. Now it's important to note that your PDF report needs to be created and published using OpenOffice. Make sure that any link that you enter into your PDF report is formatted using the dynamic token as shown here. Now let's see what that looks like on the front end. Enter our affiliate ID. Here's the image of the report. And all the affiliate has to do now is click rebrand and generate report. And the report's automatically rebranded and downloaded to their desktop. Let's open it up. And if I hover over the link, you can see in the lower right hand corner that my affiliate link has been updated with my unique affiliate ID.